Well, more job opportunities on WTOL 11 Your Day this morning. If you've wanted to work in or around law enforcement, Monroe County is hiring. Monroe County Sheriff Tori Goodenough joins us this morning. Good morning, Sheriff. Thanks for joining us today. Good morning and thank you for the opportunity to be on your show. Absolutely. So you are hiring a variety of positions right there, uh, right now in Monroe County. Yes, ma'am. We currently have positions uh, open in our corrections division, as well as our deputy sheriff, our uh, certified law enforcement. Okay, so depending on what you might be interested in, there could be an opportunity for you. Uh, talk me through how people can go about applying and, and maybe obtaining a position. So there's a couple ways that you can apply. Um, we prefer it being online um, through the Monroe County um, website, the County of Monroe website. You can click on a link there to apply online, or um, you can also print an application and drop it off at our, at the courthouse. There's a drop box there um, to drop applications off, but obviously online, uh, it, it, it um, speeds up the process. Sure, sure. So what kind of requirements, uh, background uh, do, you, do you need on, on folks uh, to be qualified for a position? So for the position of corrections officer, um, you have to have a high school diploma or a GED, a valid Michigan driver's license and be over the age of 18. Um, the same criteria applies for a deputy sheriff. Okay, and do they need to go through uh, some academy training or anything like that? So a couple things for a corrections officer, they do not. Um, obviously experience in law enforcement or criminal justice, a degree, certainly, um, gives them the uh, edge up opportunity, um, but they do not. When we hire our correction officers um, within the first year of hiring, we then send them to the Corrections Academy. We pay for the uh, all the expenses related to the Academy and their wages. Uh, and right now we're using Washtenaw Community College and that Academy is four weeks long. If there are certified police officers that are interested in joining our department, um, that, uh, that too is a plus. Um, However, if they are not certified, we do promote from within the jail. Um, after two and a half plus years uh, as being a corrections officer, we hold interviews and if selected, then we send you to the police academy. So talk a little, that's a benefit right there and an opportunity to, to grow within. Uh, what are some of the other benefits uh, in working with the, the uh, county? So um, currently our corrections officers work 12 hour shifts, which is, uh, they work seven out of 14 days, um, every other weekends along a three day weekend. And we know that um, our millennials, they appreciate their time off. So we've adopted the 12 hour shift, uh, or has been in the jail for some time. And the road patrol is now looking at transitioning to 12 hour shifts. We have a couple more hurdles to get over. The starting pay for a corrections officer is $19.94. And after 49 months, they reach top pay of $25.87. Um, our road patrol division starts out at uh, certified deputies 2164. And at top pay is 2987. We're currently in contract negotiations with the deputy sheriffs and uh, if they accept the contract, uh, they go to top pay in uh, 24 months. So there's healthcare benefits, um, dental, vision, um, uh, HSA for healthcare account is also available. Um, we have a wellness plan, life insurance, a defined benefit plan as well as a defined contribution, um, membership reduced rate for membership to the YMCA and uh, disability benefits. All of our officers are issued their own radio. Um, we use current model fleet and we really focus a lot on training. Uh, we believe in a lot of training uh, to give people the skill set to do their job. So who exactly are you looking for? What kind of qualities, characteristics in an applicant? Well, first and foremost, they have to be a good moral character. Um, good uh, standing citizen in the community, a good driving record, uh, not a, no criminal uh, activity on their criminal history. Um, people that uh, are team oriented. Again, we feel that um, every position here at the sheriff's office is equally important. Uh, having a good skill set, a good conflict resolution, uh, and unbiased for sure. 
Good uh, characteristics uh, to, to join the team and again get on the website, get that application started and uh, you could be on your way to a new career. Uh, Sheriff, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Thank yeah. you for your time this morning. You, you have a bet. great day. You too. Take care.